hello and welcome to today's video i'm going to be checking out some of the best vacationing content online dude. Uh, i haven't been on a vacation in five years so now i'm going to be telling you if it's even a good idea should you leave your home see ballsfam.com for discord link yeah, I mean, what going on your girl trip this year ladies let you know that you're going on your girl trip look at the minute bitch where you going what the I don't know why the f y'all even go. Y'all come back enemies every fing year, every time y'all go on a girl trip. Y'all come back hating each other. That shuttle ride back to the airport be quiet as shit, don't it? I can't stand nothing. That's why the f I don't hang with them like that. I just wanna. <laughs> five days is too much. I hate these bitches. I just wanna see my family. See, guys, we different. When, with, with the fellas, when we go on the guys trip, we come back with a better bond, closer together as brothers. Right, fellas? Our relationship is tight, you know what I'm saying? Cause y'all know we did some sneaky nasty sh on a trip nobody know about sh <laughs> like ordering escorts, doing cocaine, gambling and sh Look how quiet the man got like, hey man, I'm trying to go to Vegas this year, man, come on <laughs> <laughs> Absolutely true, why do women go on trips when obviously theirs are such tension? Uh, social structures uh, between people are fucking awesome and cool Squid Games is the only vacation that you should go on and trust that nothing erroneous is gonna happen because you're being watched by cameras all day. Hell yeah, I love the future. Have you ever thought about going on vacation to the United States of America? Well, here's why you shouldn't. Wyoming, Montana, I- This is the entirety of Wyoming right here. If you step foot into Wyoming, this is all you will see is dirt. Idaho. Explore the this stunning is Idaho. natural wonders of the Obviously. first national park in the world, home to geysers, hot springs, waterfalls, and diverse wild lift. Oh my bears, god, what is that bulls. wild lift? Those are the great bison. Look at them mother flipping damn. Okay, so first off, in the United States, we have Yellowstone Park. Obviously, that's where most people think would be willing to go to the middle of the country for no reason. It's no beaches. One of the world's most famous natural landmarks. Maybe people are trying Whether to escape like, beaches. Hike the trails, take a helicopter tour, or ah, simply yes. soak in the breathtaking. These people right here are not wealthy enough to take the helicopter tour over the giant divot. Vistas. Yosemite uh, National Park. Alright, now Yosemite is fucking classic, dude. I've never been here. That Cover looks amazing. The inspiring beauty of towering granite cliffs, majestic waterfalls. Whoa and ancient sequoia trees. We could just camp out there. Hiking, rock climbing are a few of the activities. Hiking, to... rock climbing. Wow, what great freaking advice and tips. I will be going to no national park and rock climbing because you cannot do that safely uh, off trail. You're just endangering other species and polluting the area. I'm going to the Grand Canyon. Cause I'm a goddamn American. Ah, uh, you should really see Paris one day. I don't want to go to Paris to see no hunk of metal. <laughs> I f hate French people. We're doing something extremely special this year. I've been on 17 cruises before, <laughs> all to the Caribbean. This is gonna be my 18th to Mexico. <laughs> <laughs> uh, these are trips throughout the years. Obviously, the Gen Xers had it the best. The money was free flowing in the. I'm pretty much a world traveler cruises. at this point. I can't wait to try their McDonald's. Am I? <laughs> <laughs> so adventurous. Going on vacation? <laughs> uh, yeah, of course I'm going on vacation. If by vacation you mean sitting on the couch watching reruns of The Office with my dog. <laughs> <laughs> You're not traveling? Oh, that's a funny story. I can't afford that. <laughs> vacation? <laughs> cool. <laughs> Everybody knows Millennials and Gen Z are the same people, so why prioritize it? Oh yes, Gen Z wears beanies. Of course I'm going on vacation this year. Hold on one second. Hey dad, are we going on vacation this year? Another <laughs> cruise? <laughs> oh, it's to Mexico. Okay. Yeah, I'm going on a cruise to Mexico. <laughs> I'm pretty much a world traveler at this point. <laughs> I'm not going with my parents. Back in my day, your lunch break at the asbestos factory was a vacation. Oh, uh, okay. You smell like you're an Italian. <laughs> oh shit, this dude does the generationals video so good, man. My favorite has to be the Gen X and 
These are the same people, man. The millennials are still asking their parents for all their money. Because apparently printing money does not make you more wealthy unless you have money to begin with to let it exponentially grow off of for many years. Except for this poor fellow who never left the asbestos factory and we should all be thankful that we are living in the modern world. Subscribe for more content. Uh, I try to stay away from there now because, you know, daddy likes to play a little bit of blackjack. This dude looks like he works for a uh, rocket market. I like to lose a little bit, but uh, if I had to make a choice, I'd go up to like Mammoth, you know, go fishing, go snowboarding, things like that. That's kind of what, in my way. In the same trip? <laughs> and I think the older I get, the, the less camping I want to do. So I like to have a five-star resort, maybe on a, maybe up in Mammoth or something like that. Relax, get a good time, get a comfortable bed. That's kind of my dream vacation. Or a beach. Y'all want to take me to Hawaii, we'll go. <laughs> Hell yeah. Have you ever heard of spending $15,000 on a single weekend in Colorado? Because that's the future of fun. Hell yeah. Mammoth. All right, now let's go to somewhere where everybody can afford to live. Canada. French Canada. You could afford to live here, but at what major cost? You will have to learn to speak French and ease. You will have to endure uh, the culture of not being English. Can you do that? Oh, what a pretty area. No wonder it should be its own country completely different oh my god Did I <laughs> is Quebec not the French one yes yes it is they have to convince people to go here with their marketing campaigns they're like please man Wait, I put this together and I didn't get a single thumbs up for the French. I wonder why. I wonder why. You fucking French. Lazy gosh dang French. Didn't help us out very much. Why would we help you out? We got our revenge a few times. Why don't you put up the little white flag now, boyo? Now that your tourism dollars are not speaking French. Right, thank you so much for watching. Out of all of these, I would go vacation in I want to say a cave <laughs> because this would be the greatest sightseeing would be 1000 miles underground goodbye yo all your trackies and tv addicts don't mean to dance don't mean to bring static all your clingers in your grandma's house grab your back street friend and get loud blowing doors off hinges grab me with the pinches and no i didn't retire i snatch you off with the needle nose pliers you love all my home